Good morning again, everybody. Again, over at Dark Archer Customs again. And just uh, up here enjoying the sunrise, apparently, because don't see any elk yet, unfortunately. This never ceases to amaze me. Won't see any elk sign around, but of course there's deer all over in this crazy deep snow up here right now. A dozen deer or so, moose, but no sign of the elk. I thought maybe some footprints I saw were, <clears throat> were the elk, but I think it was just this moose I have down below me, unfortunately. <clears throat> so I'm going to probably head up to the, to the ridge here and poke off the other side and see if I can see anything that maybe I can come up after tomorrow. I don't know. It's been a long trek. Took me about three hours to get into here almost so so I got some time in front of us but it's a beautiful day that is for sure far nicer than when I came up last time so we'll update you and hopefully we'll see some see some elk here pretty soon well <clears throat> found a couple of elk Unfortunately, they are a little farther away than is feasible to get to at the moment from my current position. <clears throat> so, work out a plan here and watch them for a second. And maybe come up tomorrow morning and give it a try. We'll see if they don't get blown out today. Certainly a possibility. Hmm. Oh, that sucks. I hate that. I also hate that my pants are frozen. Oh, you got wet. That's like walking with <laughs> trash cans on your legs. <laughs> well, well, maybe we'll get lucky and we'll find something closer to me but at least I have a couple targets at least finally see if we can make it happen three more days after today all right let's go find some closer ones All right, back up on the hill this morning. Saw several elk, all of them bulls, and they are just wired for sound for sure. Been trying to track down these three, keep getting on their beds, and just can't quite close the gap without them smelling me or hearing me or whatever it is. Probably a little bit of both. And had them slowed down, they are feeding, and went slowed it up, and I got one that I kicked off one direction, I don't know where the other two went yet, so head back and see if I can track down the other two. I got Pete up on the hill above me, and he was tracing another track, and so far, no joy, but it's all good. Thanks for coming along with me. Be sure to uh, subscribe so you get more updates. Only got a couple more days for this hunt, and then got to the end of January for cow tag. So at least a little while for some more hunt updates. So um, we'll give you guys an update here in a minute when I get to this next ridge line. Well, Pete, what happened to the elk?
We could try harder. I don't think we can. Oh. I mostly agree with that for sure. I guess we could stay up here and chase tracks all day. Yeah, you know. We're heading down for the day. Hopefully. Maybe tomorrow. Pete? Yeah. All right. I'm definitely going to go glass on the Yeah, for sure. I don't know if I'm going to be able to hike tomorrow or not, but I'm going to go try and find something. <laughs> <laughs> Pete the hero. Ah uh, no. I'd be a hero if I had a push my right body. <laughs> yeah, well, same, oh, here. Versa, but... same here. Same <laughs> here. <I'm... laughs> it's okay. Everyone needs some Pete's in their life. Alright. Till next time.